Alright, in this video I'm taking a quick look at this LED desktop lamp. It is also a phone charger. It'll charge your watch and it'll charge your earbuds. Primarily for uh, Apple devices, but I'm using it right now with the Samsung Galaxy Note 9 in a rugged case that also has a uh, pretty thick piece of Velcro on the back and it's actually charging just fine. Charger disconnected. So we'll set that to the side. So included with this real quickly is a thank you and contact card, always nice to see. A small user manual or user guide, but it actually works quite well in explaining how this works. So real quickly, this is a foldable design, so you can have this adjusted up and down. That's the only adjustment aspect that you have to the actual light in terms of movement, but of course you can turn it off and turn it on and change the brightness just by touching and holding, and you can dim this down so you can see it's actually quite dim, and I'm gonna make it brighter by touching and holding and we're at maximum brightness. Nice thing is, it's sort of a softer, uh, warm light, so it's not going to be blinding or jarring in any way. So that's really, really nice as far as that goes. So I'm going to go ahead and tilt that down a little bit. So here is our charging area for our telephone. Obviously, primarily going to be designed for a vertical orientation, uh, obviously because of the style. So that's something to keep in mind. The digital clock display is both 12 and 24 hour so depending upon which you prefer and you do have an alarm option if you wish and all of the settings are done via pressing and holding with short and long presses I'm not here to be an instruction manual so I'm not going to get into that too much but I'll go ahead and fold this down turn this off turn this around on the back side, we have our input for our Type-C cable that is included, as well as the small, I call it brick, that comes with, uh, used to come with a lot of phones, but it's a QC, so it's quick charging capable, so you're going to get the fast charge. You don't have to find your own uh, adapter to make that happen. It is included. That's always a nice thing to see. And on the back are a few other things. You have this little door that you can open up and you're going to have your connectivity on the inside here where you connect the actual little, uh, let's call it charging puck for your watch. Bear with me because I don't have uh, AirPods. I just don't have them or need them. And I don't have a watch. But this is going to be going to someone who actually does own an iPhone and they do own a watch, an iWatch. So, not going to be a problem. For them, they'll pop open this door hook in their cable and then route that through. Up here we have this little flip out and that is where the little puck is going to rest and then the watch is basically just going to lay right on there and charge and as far as the uh, iPods, if you had some iPods they would sit just like that and they would charge. Now this one, if I turn it sideways because the charging is actually on the bottom here you can actually see that it is charging. You see the green lights that lit up. So all of the different areas are functional. It's lightweight. It has a sort of a rubber base. It's not going to scratch or damage anything. Shouldn't slide around if the surface is a little uneven. And the cable, and it's probably about, I don't know, two and a half, three feet. And again, uh, this is detachable, it's just type C, and you do have the adapter included. So you don't have to worry about finding your own. As I said before, that's always a great benefit. You get the fast charging up to 15 watts right out of the box. And speaking of the box, this is the box that it arrives in. Nothing too flashy or fancy, but all in all, I think this will be a really nice option for the person this is going to. They can have their phone and they can have their watch charging simultaneously and at some point in the future if they get some AirPods 
they can charge those as well. So all in all, very, very nice. The touch sensitivity on this is really, really good. So it doesn't take much. You can change the different colors. I like the warm, as I was talking about before, so you don't have that harshness. But if you're into the cool, you can also do that. That's pretty much it. Just a very simple to operate, I think, light. Uh, again, pressing and holding, short, long presses. That's how you make all your changes, uh, holding both buttons. When it's in setup, it's going to change between 12 and 24. But all of that's outlined really well in the manual in case you need it. You can refer to that. It does have a little PM indicator, and when the alarm is set, there is an indicator for that. So that's pretty much it. I'm not going to use the alarm. I'll leave that up to the other person. Uh, it's not super loud, but by any means, if you want to find out more about this, check out the link below. Thanks for watching.